how to groom a pug. Starring Sophie. Step one, brushing. First, you need to thoroughly brush through your pug's coat to get rid of any shedding fur. Pugs shed a lot, so this step might take a while. Step 2. Bathing. The first thing to do when your pug is in the bathtub is to squirt ear wash into your pug's ear and massage it in. Next, you need to wet the dog completely. After your pug is wet, apply tear free baby shampoo to the top of their head, chin, and under their eyes and chin. Rub it in well. Apply regular dog shampoo to the back of your pug's head and ears. Massage both of the shampoos together around the face. Apply dog shampoo to the rest of your pug's body, making sure you don't forget the belly, legs, or tail. Massage the shampoo in with a soft rubber scrubby. Make sure to scrub it in circular motions. Next, rinse your pug completely and make sure you also rinse their face. Apply dog shampoo to your pug's body again and massage it with a rubber scrubby. The face does not need to be washed again. Rinse your pug completely. Apply cream rinse. Step 3. Drying. Dry your pug with a towel and put them in a crate with a dog dryer for 30 minutes. Step 4. Finishing up. is dry, go over their coat with a soft, short, bristled brush. After you comb your pug, trim and file their nails and spray them with dog cologne. Apply your pug's collar and other accessories and your pug is now clean, groomed, and ready to go. For the past few months, I have been doing a field study for the tutorial center at Phoebe's Dog on Details, a dog grooming and boarding shop in Manchester. Working in a dog grooming and boarding shop may not seem like much, but it can actually be a very interesting experience. Although I love dogs, I did not start this field study just to work with dogs. I started this project to learn about owning a small business. This field study has taught me that working in a dog grooming and boarding shop is a lot more than just working with dogs. It takes a lot of learning, organization, and everyday skills. During this experience, I did things that I already knew how to do, and I learned how to do things that I've never done.